Wow. Three years. Happy birthday to the YouTube channel. As well as the Instagram. Those are the two social medias that started this mission to bring awareness to mental health for first responders and tell my story. So hopefully it resonates with somebody and they seek help or they start their journey. And having said that, my journey started back in 2017. So let me tell you my story. <laughs> Playing golf one day with my buddy Ryan Johnson, who's you've seen on the channel. He luckily had just went through our peer support 40-hour uh, class and learned about signs to look for and stuff like that. So I opened up to him out on the golf course for some reason. I don't know why. And told him I'd just blown up at my son, who at that time is four years old in 2017, for no reason. You know, I there was triggers for me. Anger. Um, the cumulative load, the allostatic load is what it's called, but that cumulative load builds up over time. You don't realize what's changing in you. And so... Ryan told me, he said, Steve, you don't realize what this job's done to you, do you? And that resonated with me. So that's the mission, to try to share my story. You know, something that I do remember my wife saying during all those struggle years was that they preferred it when I was at work because they got peace at that time. Now think about that. At the moment, it didn't it didn't resonate with me, and it should have, right? Uh, pretty powerful now. It was powerful then, but I didn't understand it. Now I understand what what happened to me. So from 2017 to now, boom, the journey, my awareness, my journey has been building. But from 2017 to 2020, when I started all this, there was a lot of trepidation. You know, for first of all, trying to start something like this, but even seeking to go get help. But that journey allowed me that self-awareness from my research, went and got help. And then I thought, there's more people out there that have the same, probably the same problems that I'm having. I've had spouses contact me. I've had first responders contact me and say, that's me, Steve. Um, so it's doing what I thought it could do. But before that, you know, the trepidation to even start all this because I didn't even know how to film. I didn't know how to edit. You know, all I had was Facebook. And so it was a lot of trepidation leading up to even starting this. But boom, January of 2020, I started it all on YouTube and Instagram. And here we are now, three years later. Um, I've gotten better at filming, got better mics, better camera. So... <laughs> You can go back and watch that old footage, and you're like, man, I'm not watching this. I'm going to go watch his more, his more uh, modern stuff, if you want to call it that. But, um, but that social media stuff led to the First Responder Golf Foundation with the help of a golf pro here in Kansas City who contacted me through that social media and said he loved what, he loved what I was doing for firefighters, but he wanted to include the, the cops, the nurses, the doctors, you know, all first responders. And I thought, yes, yeah, I, I want to do that. Let, let's do something. So then COVID was around and we couldn't meet. And the next thing you know, you know, I'm wanting to host a golf tournament to raise money for all this. And I started the foundation, the not-for-profit, the First Responder Golf Foundation. So we pay for first responders to get on the golf course. And it's about spreading that awareness as well as providing an outlet to recalibrate and decompress. So if you don't like golf, and you're watching this video as a first responder, find an outlet that helps you, okay? We do have the resources now to provide help for first responders. So this has grown into something special. I'm excited to see where it grows from here. Um, we're, we're continuing to provide that outlet. Um, we do simulator stuff, we're doing yoga, we're doing miniature golfs coming up so we can have the families involved um, because we as first responders live society's trauma but our families live that trauma that we bring home. So that's a pretty powerful message there. Anyway, I'm excited for this journey to continue. Please like and subscribe and follow and make comments. All that stuff that helps this bring eyes to the mission. Because someone's going to see this stuff years from now when I'm done off this earth. 
and this will hopefully help someone. That's what the social media blitz is about. Um, yeah, so I'm excited for the for the future. Thanks for uh, all the support. If you just found this channel, please support it. Um, just watch, subscribe. It's free. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work. No, I, I love doing the work. It's a passion of mine now, and I just feel like this whole thing was a it was a calling. All right, I met Mac today. He's a skeet patrol at Breckenridge. That's me. That's him. And he asked me what the camera equipment was all about. And I've often thought, do I want to keep doing this daily grind with social media, YouTube, or just can run the foundation by itself? This is why I do it. It's because he asked me, I talked to him, he told me that he has seen some things doing the ski patrol. Yep. And that is a first responder as well. So, Mac, man, I'm glad I met you. Yeah, likewise, and I'll just add to that, I, uh, I appreciate what you're doing. I see a tremendous value in it, and... Uh, I know just running into you and, and seeing the way that you listen to people, I know that you are going to be able to help me in the future. So I, uh, I appreciate what you're doing. Yep. Brother, love you. Love you too, man. Yep. It just came to me one day. I don't know how to describe it. Um, a calling to help. I mean, I'm already serving. Um, but someone needs to serve and help our brothers and sisters and bring this awareness out there because I just, I don't think a lot of them understand what's happening to them. Um, you know, egos get in the way, uh, whatever it might be. Anyway, love you all. Stay self-aware. That's our motto. Um, start your journey today. All right. Love you all. Stay self-aware.